is a problem. What problem? Presuming I ripped Tioma. Print down your voice, print down your voice. Is that a joke? I saw Tioma run out of the living room crying. Her dress was torn. She refused telling me what happened. What? She has told the two prints. Are you sure that is the truth? Because Prince Obina that I know cannot do that. I mean, I don't know. Anything can be possible in this life. Maybe he has done it out of frustration. Hey! Mm -hmm. This is serious. Very serious. Mm -hmm. Mother's decision. Let's stop. Please, let's go for the conversation. Are you out of your mind? Are you stupid? How do you let the accusation against me? Obina. If you lay your hands on her, I will be very angry with you. Father, this is an insult. This is an insult to me, Father. Igwe Biko, do not allow any form of intimidation in this matter. Just tell me, basically, ever. Who is intimidating who here? Who? You are the one intimidating her not to say the truth. Be say. say. Okay. Be careful what you say to my son. Then, tell your son not to intimidate her. Tell your son to say the truth. What truth are you talking about? The truth and nothing but the truth. I can see that you're sick in the head. You are Metiano. What's your problem? Anu Abogo. Tell him to say the truth. He said they may be God do say. He said they may be God. Let him say the truth. It is Ranaka. Enough of this. Okay. We quit business. Our Let go of her. Is it because she's a maid? Why are you going to marry me? Check on me. Why are you going to marry me? 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 We are living in peace and harmony. Great is no. No, the Golan man. What brings you to my house? Your presence is needed at the palace. The Igwe wants to see you immediately. I hope all is well. That I cannot say. Godemma. <sighs> Wait, I'm coming, eh? The elders have gathered. She's still insisting that you raped her. You see, I'll have no option than to strangle that girl with my bare hands. Obina, this is a serious issue. I did not do it. I didn't rape her. I mean, why must I? But, but she said she's going to swear an oath she's to sick. that. She's sick. That girl has gone mad. This is a scandal and I'm not going to take it. See that girl? She's leaving this palace today. No. Obina mother is worried. I don't even know what to do anymore. Greetings, my prince. Yes, what is it? The Igwe demands your presence immediately. Leave my presence. Thank you, my prince. Get out. My father is getting me upset. My father is making me angry. I mean, why should he believe such a cheap lie from that girl in the first place? I mean, why would anybody think I would rape? Hi. No. Brother, you need to go and know why father summoned you. You need to go. No, Bina. 
please. Please. is putting her life in danger oh. hmm. and Abara kills instantly. Choma is so confident about it and they said after 24 hours hmm? and nothing happens to her, hmm? that means Prince Obina actually raped her. I know what that means. He will hmm. cease to become the crown prince and the heir to the throne of Amethiti. This is becoming something else. Hmm. Wow. Choma's confidence has made some of the leaders believe she's saying the truth. What if she's lying? You think she can come out of this alive? Adia, I don't know. I'm just confused. <laughs> Meaning, Prince Ejofo might become the crown prince and heir apparent to the throne. Adia, I don't know. Yes. Hey. At last, your Mario no will start. This is unbelievable. I don't think Choma can come out of this alive. Who? Miss Obina cannot do such thing. I never huh. say. But let's keep praying. Let's watch. Let's have a close. Let's keep praying, my. Hey, hey, The overconfidence in that maiden gives me concern. I have no doubt that to believe that the prince did it. But why should Prince Obina rape a palace maiden even in the heat of all the problems he's facing? Why? Well, uh, he must have done that out of frustration. Don't you know what frustration can do to a man? But there's not somebody like Prince Obina. The young man is responsible more than a Jofo. Well, I'm not saying that he's not responsible. What I'm saying is that uh, someone who is in frustration can do just anything. Yes. Well, the young lady has taken the oath. Let us now wait for the result in the next 24 hours. Well, uh, uh, all I know is that out of the two, one thing must happen. Is it that the prince, the, the, the maiden dies, or, or the prince ceases to be the crown prince? Oh, yes. It's of you. <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, this this kingdom cannot every day wants to every day and, and you know what annoys me I love Prince Obina too much. Okay, but I don't know. You know what annoys me I love Obina too much. Hearing this type of story. What uh, you Thank you. Oh yeah, maybe you are Ah ah. Hmm. Oh yeah. Ah, I got it, man. Ah, let me. No, hey, Buka. Ah, that one who knows where he has gone to. Oh, how much you are here? Yes, Father. Just thinking and asking myself why would Prince Obina rip a palace maiden? Well, um, honestly, I've been thinking about that too. Yet couldn't get any reasonable answer. Why do I have this? A strong feeling that someone paid her to say that. 
My instinct tells me that. Why would any same person do that? And why would the girls wear before they are about to try it? Knowing that her life is in danger. Father, are you of the opinion that I'll be mad at it? Well, that's not what I'm saying, but let's wait for the result of the oath taking to come out. Then we can conclude. I really do feel sorry for him. I mean, from one issue to another, we are not even done with his ex-girlfriend getting pregnant for him. And now this rape. That's such a strong one. I'm, I'm confused. Why are all these things coming up at the same time? I'll go visit him. I've been avoiding him. I haven't spoken with him for a while now. It is high time I went. It's all right. How did you get the information? HFO called me. Now, wow. But how could he do a thing like that? Obi and I will never do a thing like that. I, I know Obi and He will never, ever do such a thing. No, not my Obi and How do you mean? Okay, I think I have a lot of things to tell you. Let's go inside. Listen, I don't need to hear it. Hold that thing you want to tell me to yourself. I mean, are you okay? He kept you in this condition, yet you are here defending him. If you, what is wrong with you? I am not defending him. I know. Do you know Obina more than me? Obina will never do such a thing. That's why I said let's go in. I mean, let's talk inside. Oh, really? Really? Madam, I am not interested in that thing you want to tell me. Okay? And do me a favor, please, do not spit me in between. Do not even try it again. I am not interested. Can you calm down? Is it possible for you to really calm down? Can you? Ife, I am so, so disappointed in you. I am disappointed in you. I am disappointed in Obina. In fact, I am disappointed in everything that is going on these days. Please, <sighs> I am no longer interested. Don't tell me anything. Make use of it. Calm down and listen. Let's go inside. Calm down and listen. Miss, I don't understand the reason why a man will keep you in this condition. You, a full grown woman, and you are here defending him. For crying out loud, who does that? Can you really calm down? Can we go inside and talk, please? Um, I'm going to make use of my legs, okay? Really? Yes, excuse me. I, 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 are you really serious right now? I'm going to take Okada. Okada! You. <laughs> Also come to accuse me. What are you doing here? You've been avoiding me. I am sorry about that. The truth is, I've
What are you doing here? What are you doing with this rapist? Hey, it's your fault. Stop that. What do you mean I should stop it? This is a rapist. You shouldn't be seen around him. It's your fault. It's your fault. Please don't do use that. I don't use what? You're a rapist. Everybody knows you're a rapist. What is it? You shouldn't be hey. seen around. Do you really love yourself? Listen to me. No, do you love yourself? Look away. You shouldn't be standing around this person. Please, if you love yourself, oh no, don't do this to yourself. No, this is a rapist. It's your fault. It's your fault. I will not warn you. It's your fault. I'm warning you. It's your fault. Stop that nonsense. It's your fault. It's your fault. It's your fault. It's your fault. His weapon is on fire. It's your fault. 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 It's okay, no, wait, wait. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> what about the the maiden that took oath this afternoon? She's still alive? Yes, she's very much alive now. Okay, my being to the queen. Thank you, Nai. Okay. I will take my leave now. All right. Hmm? <sighs> Less than 24 hours from now, Prince Obina will lose his position as the Crown Prince of this land to Jofo. That is, if nothing happens to the median. Yes. What is it? Not you know. But oh, you look worried. Please, I'm fine. Just let me be. Are you sure you are fine? What do you mean by that? Have you come to put words in my mouth? Be coming down now, or are we quarreling? Please, I don't need disturbance. Leave you a beg. So why are you not shouting at me? Why are you shouting at me now? Eh? one that you are in my house this early. Oh, I, I hope all is well. Uh, yes, all is well. I came to find out whether you have heard anything from the palace. Uh, you see, I, 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 I just woke up from sleep. I have not heard anything. Uh, well, since last night I've been worried. Huh? I don't want Pisubina to lose his position. We need to find out what is going on. Uh -oh. Are you saying that we should go to the palace? Exactly. Oh, no, no. George, if we go to the palace, it will look as if we are trying to smell fish. And it will be suspicious. So I, I, I rather advise we should put our ears open. Whatever fit us in, then we take it. Oh, the suspicious. Uh, mm. It's okay. But if you hear anything, don't hesitate to uh, let me. Of, of course, you know me. Uh, we, I'm, it's, it's already in your yes. You know the people we are dealing with are very... Of course, of course yeah. I know. I had a dream where Prince Obina died. They were about to bury him, then I woke up. Papa? Papa? 
You didn't say anything about what I just told you. This man thinks I'm Your father wants to see you. What is going on? The elders are here. They are downstairs with your father. I'm sure you must be thinking I am guilty since nothing has happened to Choma. I tell you with all my heart, I am innocent. I did not commit this. I am short of words. I don't know how I'm going to face Odons and her son. I don't know how I'm going to face them. Mom, I will not keep quiet over this issue. Honestly, I must get to the root of this matter, no matter what it takes. I imagine a job parody himself as the heir apparent to the throne. And very soon, he will be crowned prince. Are you bothered? <sighs> Mom, our people say that every day is for the thief, but just one day is for the owner of the house. You're right, son. You're right. The gods are watching. They are seeing everything. Don't bother yourself. Come and see your father. Come and answer him. Hey, 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 This is true. Papa, hmm? you don't look happy. Is everything all right? Hmm. Ebuka, Prince Obina is no longer the crown prince of this land. What? And Prince Ejofo has taken over as the crown prince and the heir apparent. Why? Papa, that means Obina really raped the maiden. That is it. But he kept denying it. That is the problem. He kept denying the fact that he raped the maiden. So, Papa, what about the maiden? Where is she? She's still in the palace. Hmm. Papa, Papa, hmm? I don't think he did it. Will you shut up there, man? Do you think that Abra is a weak deity? He kills within 12 hours. If the maiden did not, if the prince did not do it, the maiden would have been dead by now. Do you think she did it? Hmm? 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 Switched off. Switched off. Really? Huh? If he, I blame you so much for this thing, eh? How could you do such a thing? He will never forgive you for tarnishing his image. You won't blame me now. I can't just watch him slip away like that. I can't let another woman have him. Seriously? Me. Even me, your own friend, you made me believe that everything is true. If you, how could you? I just said I'm sorry. I thought I begged you. I'm sorry. I am sorry. Okay. Keep calling his number. Keep calling. Call. What do you want me to do now? Call the number now. If he call the number. Is he telling me switch off? What do you want me to do now? Pay him a visit. 
I cannot pay him a visit. I need to talk to him first. Okay, what if I get there and he throws me out of his house? Then you pay him a visit again. If you go to that guy's house, he throw you out. Pay him another visit to show remorse about what you have done. Yes! For real, what do you want me to do now? Sweetheart, go to his house. Better see, go on your knees and beg him. Hmm? You don't know how to cry. Cry for this guy, cry. Hold his leg. Hold him very well and tell him, Honey, I'm sorry, forgive me. Don't come here and start asking me what you need to do. Because you, you lied to me in the first place. You lied! So, are you two trying to tell me that Chioma did not sleep here last night? Yes, my friend. We did not see her. So this morning we realized that things are no longer in our room. Meaning she ran away? Yes, my princess. Does that mean the both of you didn't see when she left? We did not. Both of you are stupid. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my queen. Get out of my presence. Sorry. But mom, why would Choma run away? Does it mean she's guilty? What happened? Choma ran away. She ran away? She left last night. Why? Last night? Last night. What is going on? Nothing. My beautiful Oma, the fairest of them all. Yes. Will you stop that rubbish? Yes. How are you? Very well, my prince. Welcome. Well, thank you. Thank you. Um, you know, I'm quite surprised. I mean, you've not come to felicitate with me over my new position in the community. I mean, that's strange, or haven't you heard I'm the new crown prince of Amatiti Kingdom? Congratulations. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, please, will you do the needful? I need to see you. Uh, kindly take me into your abode, please. Very well. Well, thank you for not keeping him waiting. Oh. Keeping the prince waiting. Uh, you too. Uh, wait here, okay? Yes, yes, yes my, my prince. prince. Are you stupid? Yes, my prince. Are you mad? Yes, yes my, my prince. prince. Will you address me properly? 
Yes, yes my, my crown prince. Why would Choma run away like that? I think something is wrong somewhere. I noticed Queen Odunze's shock expression the moment she learned about Choma's departure. Hmm. The last time I saw Choma, she was counting a huge amount of money. I couldn't ask her where she got that money from because of her changed attitude. Hmm. Something must have pushed her to run away from here. You see, like I said, um, when I become king, I am going to make right every single wrong, every single wrong my father has made in this. By listening to very ugly bad advice from his people in his council, especially somebody very close to him. Yes, do you know who that person is? Do you know the person? Obina's mother. Yes. I will make right every single wrong that man has made. Yes, when I become king. Very well. Mm. Mm. But you have to wait up until then. Your father is still alive. Are you in any way sarcastically trying to say I will make a good king? No. No, my prince. I mean, I concurred to everything you just said. Good. Say me well to your brother. How dare you. How dare you? No, Omar, how dare you? How dare you call that 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 thing's name in front of me? How dare you? Isn't he your brother? Who is my brother? Is that thing supposed to be my brother? Somebody that should be my brother, should he be like that? Should he act like that? Do I know? I don't recognize that thing as my brother. Please. Please. Let's be cautious here. Is there a problem? What I'm trying to say is that you should never ever discuss that person in front of me ever, ever again. That's what I'm trying to say here. Please. Thank you. With all due respect, my prince, I will not have you talk to me like that. Excuse me. And point of correction, please. Never you call me my prince, okay? It should be crowned prince. You understand me? For emphasis, crowned prince. All right? Add some respect to that title, crowned prince. And please, 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 what I'm trying to say here is never ever you discuss that person with me. Wait, by the fact, are you trying to tell me you're stubborn? You're trying to tell me you're stubborn? My prince, I am not proving anything. No, you're trying to prove something. You've been the one insulting yourself. Okay, you know, I'll, I'll take this this way. I will not, you know, indulge you because I don't like the angle this discussion is going, okay? I'd rather discuss with the man who is your father, you know, who will be my future subject. That is what I'll do than discuss with the woman. Have a nice day. Hey, let's go. Was it that happened between you and the Prince Jofo? Because he complained bitterly this evening when I visited Iwe. What exactly did he tell you, Father? He said you insulted him. He said that? Of 
course, yes. Father, I did not insult him. Mm -hmm. I simply sent my regards to his brother. And that was it. He snapped. Did you in any way use foul language on him? I did not, Father. As a matter of fact, he was the one who said all sorts of things. All sorts of rubbish. In all honesty, Father, I will not marry Ejofo. It is not going to work between Ejofo and I. Withdraw that language, your man. Like I said earlier, I will not marry Prince Ejofo. They should get him another. I am, I am no longer in agreement with whatever you had with the king. Do not jeopardize my relationship with Iwe. Well, uh, as for Prince Ejofo, leave him for me. I will talk to him. Father, Prince Ejofo is such an arrogant brat. I would rather settle for Prince Obina to Ejofo. Do you realize the implication of what we've just said? Someone who brought shame to himself and the entire community. Do you realize I have plans for you? I want you to be the next queen of the kingdom. And the only way we can achieve that is for you to marry the crown prince. I am sorry to disobey you, father. I will not marry Jofu. They should get him another. The only way you will not disobey me is by doing what I ask you to do. Oh my good night. Brother, have you heard how he disgraced himself at Onowu's house yesterday? Of course. Mother told me. She told me everything. It's like he's such a silly boy. He thinks he can force himself on Oma. I mean, Oma is not that kind of girl, right? She's so principled. She has no choice because the agreement has already been made between our father and Oma's father. Why is she calling me? What, 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 why can't this girl leave me alone? Why is she freaking calling me? Who? If you want, of course. She won't let me be. I suggest you pick a call to know why she has been calling. I, mean, I would never pick her call. Excuse me. Yes, what is it? The crown prince, our queen, want to make use of this place. You are you stupid? Are you out of your mind? What kind of nonsense talk is that? We do respect my prince. It's an order from the crown prince. Come on, get out of... What are you still doing here? Please, we don't want to use force on both of you. Wait a minute. Did I hear you say use force? <laughs> we do respect my prince, please. Shut up, Albino. It's another. I uh, push me up. What is wrong with you guys? Force, right? Let me see you how far your force. Me. Come on, shut up. Force me out now. No, I want to see how far your force can go. Are you stupid? Have you lost your senses? Are you out of your? Try to come and shut up. Abino. What's going on here? We asked him to leave. He refused. He shut refused. up. Why are they still here? Did you actually send these boys to come and ask me to live here? Did you? My friend, will you shut up and obey the last order from the crown prince? Get this people out of here! Are you stupid? Uh, get them out of here! I slap you! If I was you, if I, if I was you, you get them out of here! Up. If I sound you, but that's sound sounded, eh? If you sound on you, near here. No! Come now, idiot. Brother. Brother. Don't come now. Uh -huh. Brother, it's okay. It's okay. Let's get up. Oh. Sit, sit down. Sit down. I sit. said get up. And I said uh -huh. sit. Get up, Brother, my friend. Okay. Sit. Uh -huh. what, what is okay? I said stand up. Huh? I said sit. Brother. Get up. Sit down. Obina. Father. I got a report from my wife, Queen Odunze. That you almost killed her and the Jofo this afternoon. 
What is your problem? Have you not brought enough shame to this royal family? Father, this is unlike you. You didn't even ask for my own side of the story before condemning me. Why will I ask you when I already know that you have been frustrated by what you brought upon yourself? I am surprised. I mean, I am surprised you are talking to me this way, Father. You betrayed the confidence I had in you. So do not blame me. My king, Biko. Biko. Warn him. This is not the first time. Neither is it the second. He has been doing this. One day, he will injure my son and I. You. Um, father, um, not only that. You should issue him a stern warning. One Obina. He has refused to accept authority. It's our law, it's our rule. I'm the crown prince. So he should accept me as the crown prince. I would not want to hear that both of you quarrel again. Treat him as your brother, even if he's no longer the crown prince. Father, I've been doing so. But he should do the needful. He should obey my office. I'm the crowned prince. Obinna, you have to forget the past. Accept the position of your brother. Thank you. Thank you. You may all leave me. Thank you, Father. Thank you. You are happy now. You have taken his right. Your wicked plans. Mm. You are happy now. You have taken his rights with your wicked. What is the meaning of all this nonsense? What is the meaning of this? Each time my mother goes to the market, she would like to spend the whole day there just to buy food stuff. Now my father has gone out without eating anything. And me too, I'm very hungry. What is all this? I don't like this at all. I don't like it. Mama, I don't like it though. Miss, I, I have something very important to tell you. Really? And what is it? What could that be? I am not interested in whatever you have to say. Please, you have to hear me. And I said I am not interested in whatever that will come out from that shit hole you call a mouth. Please, just give me two minutes of your time. I promise I won't take your time. I said I am not interested! How else do you want me to explain it to you? Okay, I, I will go, but please, I'm still pleading. Just two minutes. Please. You sure have guts. What are you doing with her? What, what, what's going on here? She's not here for you. Uh -huh. She's here for Prince Ogina. What? What's going on? My crown prince. What? Did your mouth flip or gutter? How dare you? How dare, how dare you address him as the crown prince in front of me and, and the king? That's an insult. You need to apologize to my son now. And um, with all due respect, my queen, I will do no such thing. Father! I, what did you just say? My prince, if he is here to apologize, 
and to tell you everything. The truth and nothing but the truth. She's told me a part of it, how a for her and his... Uh, excuse me, oh my... How you give her the sum of three million naira just so she could say she's pregnant. What? Oh yes, my prince. Uh, uh, is this some kind of joke? It, no, it's a joke. It, it is true, my prince. Mm -hmm. They actually promised me the money because they said they will make you marry me instead of Oma. When I realized the, the trauma you were going through, I had to come. I am very sorry. Please forgive me, please. this fool in here. Will you get out? Uh, mother, she just says she has something to confess. Let her speak. Who are you to challenge me? My daughter, speak. We are listening. <laughs> I lied against Prince Obina. Queen Odo said they ate your food. They paid me to do that. <laughs> Good afternoon, my prince. Yes. You sent for me, my prince. I sent for you? Who told you that? <sighs> no, I didn't send for you. You can go, please. I love you, my prince. I love you. Wait, are you out of your mind? Are you? Come on, get, get, out, of, get out of this place. Make me feel like a woman, please. Oh, my God. Get out. Don't touch me, are you stupid? Come on, get out. I said get out. Watch me! Against my son, okay? Learn again. If you can't go on with the cock or canya or vacashala, hey, to fear what? I was given in the B on the day of the oath. That's why it didn't have effect on me. Then I ran away because I was afraid. Please, my prince, forgive me. Uh, uh, it wasn't my idea, Uigwe. It was not my idea. It was uh, that even brought the Ndabuyi. It wasn't me. Mother, what, 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 what are you saying? The truth. Shabalaba. Let me open up. Everybody now knows. Um, my king. I am even responsible for my son's change in attitude. Your own Mom! 
Mom, I am disappointed in you. You mean you and Ejiofo are, are aware of what has been going on in this palace? I'm disappointed in myself too. But I was doing everything so that my son would be the heir to the throne. What's that here? <laughs> Oduze! How could you? How? Why? Because of your son? Come down. Hey. Don't fight your wife in my house. Please. Oh, okay. I please. should not fight my wife in your house. Yes, please. Fine. Eh? No, it's okay. Please. Keep upgrading with her. Ah, yes. My name is you upgrade. Then you come and meet me somewhere. I am a downgrade. Nay, please. Nay. No. Hey. You may upgrade. You will downgrade with me somewhere. Okay. You will meet me or in, in my house. See what you have cost. I want you to take it easy with me. But you are too hot for me. Hey, Mecha. No See now, you're putting me into trouble. Don't hey. worry, eh? I will see him later. I will talk man to man. Eh? Yes. Man to man. When you could not stop him here. I know my husband, I know what he's capable of doing. Hey. Don't oh. worry, I've told you. I will see him hey, later. Upgrade me to cause of one trouble than the more. There's no problem. There's no problem. Oh, so bad there. So this is what my mother has been doing. That is exactly what she has been doing. In fact, I am waiting for her to come back and pick this load. It is over between us. The secret behind that her upgradement is on Ezuku's matrimonial bed. That is where she is doing her upgradement. Eh? That is the secret behind the fixing of Wivom, the mame run, the, the, the nails fixing, and the human hair. The, the, the throw back and throw front. Hey, please, it's not what you think. Oh. Please. Yes, yes. It is not what I think. And that is why I married you in the first place. Along the line, you started your own thinking and became an imperialist overnight. Now, quasi wawa. On somebody's matrimonial bed. Okay? I am highly inflammable, Victor. Look, look, in fact, let me check if there are still more of us. Now you be calm. Now you please. Mama. Ebuka, please help me beg your father. Please. Mama, I am so disappointed in you, Mama. Mama, I am so disappointed in you. Mama, how could you? How? Ebuka, be calm. Help me beg him first. After you can blame me. I should go and beg my father. Be calm, Mama. Me. I'm your mother, please. Okay. Just wait. Let me go and beg him. Hey. Hey. It's a Your Majesty, I did it to punish the busy of her attitude towards me. During the time, some elders and I ganged up against you. Your Majesty, I'm very sorry about that. Please forgive me. Hey. You're a very wicked man. You are wicked. So you even had an interest in this matter, yet you collected such an amount of money from me. It's the wicked. 
My queen, I'm sorry about that. You see? You have finally been exposed. You're a very wicked man. You should be ashamed of yourself. Hey! Ezuku. Ezuku. It's unfortunate I can no longer call you Anichi. You are no longer a member of my cabinet. Your red cap will be taken away from you. And you are hereby excommunicated from this kingdom. Your Majesty, you can take the red cap, take the beads, and remove me as a member of your cabinet. But please, do not excommunicate me. I will surely die if you do. God, God, take him out of this place. Please, Your Majesty. Move it. Who is the Father. Quiet! As for that maiden called Chioma, she is no longer needed in this palace. And you, Ejiofo, is no longer the crown prince of this kingdom. Obina shall take it back from you. My oh, father, father, please. I will decide. What I will do with Queen or Dunze later. Steps. 